are at Molly Stark Sanatorium. We were going to try to find a way to get in, but the park rangers have not left. One of them did. Oh, I'm sorry. One of them did leave. The one that stayed, we know he has a dog in his car because when I went to ask if it was okay if we walked around, the dog was sounded like it was going to eat me through the window. Um, there's another smaller building up front that looked like it used to be doctor's offices. So, yeah. Um, I just pushed something on my phone that I don't even know what it is, but okay. Um, Bella doesn't feel anything just yet. She probably could if we were actually inside, but it really looks like we're not getting in there today. Supposedly this place is pretty haunted though. Supposedly it has a bunch of activity. Um, huh? We're not going to be able to get inside. I don't know why I thought about that. That was just my own thing. What? Something like you would do for us. Get us inside? Sleep with the... Yeah. <laughs> anyway, this place is still extra super cool on the outside. Um, it shows lots and lots of the, it has lots and lots of the balconies that they used to put the tuberculosis patients out on for the sun. Um, this place does get an awful lot of sun and fresh air. It's quite open. Um, let's go look and see. Oh, it's a prickly bush thing. We used to have those little hollows no more. It's really prickly weed. Yeah, yeah, that thing. Um... So yeah, extra super cool. Gonna see what we can get out of this. A lot of the windows have the radiators across them. The second floor, the third floor. The first floor. Construction fastener bag garbage. We've already walked around more than half of it. Um, <laughs> no easy way to get in. Another balcony up there. Another balcony across there. This place is so cool. A what? Five. Five what? Four. Supposedly you can take tours of this place. Um, I guess I'll have to look into it. Sure don't look like we're getting in by ourselves. Oh, and it looks like my video picked up right back where I stopped it. So, yay. But, oh, I just ran into a tree branch. Excuse my pause in my video. Walk through here. Bella talked about how dangerous the ground was with all the prickers and tree stumps and holes. And I thought it was funny because she thinks the ground is dangerous but wants to go inside in a building that nobody's been in for... Shit, Bella, what I say? 23 years? Well, people have been in there, but you know what I mean. It's been yeah, abandoned for 25 people. years. People did it. Pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool. Okay. Looks like a brace of some sort. It really does. It up. I'm not going to touch it. Tuberculosis. We're at tuberculosis. A sanatorium had tuberculosis patients. Is that the car that was sitting there when we were there, or is it another car? I don't know. It looks like some kind of shed. Do you hear that? Walk over that way. Walk over this way? No, yeah, there's something like... You didn't see it. No, what? It was like about this big and it was black and it went like this and it disappeared. Oh, shit. 
Maybe what did I you do? maybe I possibly got something extraterrestrial, not extraterrestrial, supernatural on video, and maybe not because I don't think I was even pointed that way. My tree does not have AIDS. I know my ears feel like they need to pop all of a sudden. Like I went up a really high hill. Like you do when you go on an airplane or you drive up a really big hill. Like when you go to the mountains or whatever. I know I have that feeling right now. It's weird. I don't know where it came from. Um, not saying it's anything, you know, weird, weird. But it's just weird that I got it all of a sudden. Trying to focus on that door right there in between those pillar things. Hmm. Interesting. Alright. What the photo bomb? That's my beautiful Hot. daughter. Here you who's just like me because we're awesome. I really, 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 really cute. Photo bomb video. Who worked over here? Okay, we're gonna walk over here. I guess she wants to look and see what's in this shed. Not gonna be nothing. I thought that, that was the park ranger back right down the road, but I think it was just a car. Oh, there's lots of mud. What are we looking at? Oh, I see it. Oh, there's a bunch of acorns. Or Buckeyes, or whatever the fuck they're called. Um, hey, what is that? They are, they are, um, construction earmuffs. Out here in the middle of nowhere. At least they look like construction earmuffs. Out here in the middle of nowhere. They're supposed to have music things inside. They're supposed to at least have something to cover your ears so they don't... They're broken, but that's what they are. Kind of weird to be in the middle because now that we're in the woods next to the... No good. Next to the sanatorium. Just so a bunch of woods. The park ranger said that we could... There's hand sanitizer in the Porta John. I'm good. Um, the park ranger did say we could walk in the woods if we wanted, but... I don't know if we really want to do that. I was just filming the sky the that whole time I was walking good. through the thing. Oh, that was pretty cool. That's a water tower or whatever that thing That's a water tower. Hmm. Okay, there's noises coming from this shed. I don't know if it's like electrical. Sounds like a washer. Oh, it does. Open it. What is it here to power? It's locked. Well, it's got to be some kind of power or something for somebody, but it definitely ain't for the hospital, huh? Some of it in hospital still have running water and lights. Why? I don't know. This one sure don't look like it does, but it might. Well, people, like my videos, they go to stuff like this, and then they try the water, and they, they, they come on, and some lights will flicker still. Maybe. Maybe that's why it sounds old. <laughs> Maybe they do those kind of things to keep it from uh, falling apart faster, but I'd love to get inside this one. Molly Stark Sanatorium. Don't do that. Come on, you're no fun. She was twerking to the washing machine noise, but then quit when I tried to get her. Watch the mood. Definitely interesting. Definitely cold as shit. 
definitely fun. Look, it looks like that one. Huh? The one in the middle from that one and that one it looks like a screaming mouth and then eyes. If you look at it, cricket. Get it? With the big hole? It sure does. Alright. I ain't even seen it. Bye! I ain't even seen a spot. Alright, I know I paused my video again, but we're coming up onto the front. We've almost walked completely around. My car's over there behind the fence. There is a desk or something stopped in that open, broken window. Airplane. But I just wanted to get the front of this place. Red Robin. Yum. On. In my video. <laughs> Don't touch that. You'll get electrocuted. It looks way cool. Oh, thanks, Mom. I know I look. Ooh. Sorry. Uh, here's a sign that says caution. Asbestos. Cancer and lung disease hazard. Authorized personnel only. So, in a place that they house, <laughs> this is how crazy things were way back in the day. In a place that housed people with tuberculosis, which, as you all know, is a bad disease of the lungs where you basically cough up blood until you die from it. I guess back then some people got better. But how ironic that this place is full of asbestos which most places were way back then. I guess I think this place was built in 1923. Um, so there you go. If we were to get in there, Bella, we'd probably have to wear Mask. masks. Here you go, King. Go. You don't see mine? No, not really. It's following up. Um, it's also like 25 degrees out. But you don't see our breath. No. So, Bella, and then I saw something come through the fence, like as if it was my breath. Okay, well, but, are you feeling anything right now like you did at that other place or no? See, and my ears, I don't feel like my ears need to pop anymore. <clears throat> and way over there, that little white thing over the hill, way over there between that little tiny building and the end of the hospital is the park ranger still sitting there with his dog, waiting for him. I mean, for us to break in there so he could let his dog loose. I just figured it out, Bella. That's why he's sitting here as a dog. Trespassers. Runners. Sick em. Sick em, Billy Bob canine dog. Anywho, this place is so cool. Oh, look at those staircase. I'm sure we could get over that fence. Like, not the fence, but like the railing. Or I can, anyway. What are you talking about? The railing is the first one. Do I have to get up there? It's not about getting in the actual building. I'm sure we could easily find a way to get in the building, but... I know. It's getting through this fence. Why is that window upside down? They both look that way. Why? I don't know. We'll have to look at pictures of what it looked like. Anyway, there's a ramp right there in front of me. It's connected to that little orange piece. It's where they took their wheelchairs and stuff. More balconies where they put them in the sun. More balconies over the front door. A bunch of people that went in there. Through that front door to get better. Beds in there. I bet you there is yeah. hospital beds and machines. That's and the only color of this building. That is on the Google search shit. And it means something right there above those arches. Of course, for some reason, you can't really see it autofocus. 
Right. Can you really see the purple? Colors. Anyways, those two circles are some kind of insignia. I have to look on Google again for what exactly it means. It means something about prosperity and health or something. So interesting that they put it on. I smell more of a key. There's the ramp I was talking about. It's the front door. Oh, and you smell it? Right there's the park ranger that hasn't moved no. since we got here.